What is up everybody? I hope you're having a healthy, happy, and fantastic day. My name is Justin Michael. We're gonna be checking out Belmont High School. This is Spot Guide LA. Let's have a great day today. Way smoother than yesterday. Let's do this. Damn. All right, y'all, we're here at Belmont. We got the two fences down. We are going to check out this iconic historic skate spot. I've been here one time before, but it's always been a dream of mine to come here since, yeah, I've seen Girl Year, right? And it's amazing. So we're gonna show you what it looks like walking up to it. Oh, dang. There it is. There it is. Dang, the Belmont Nine. Wow. Wow. It never gets old seeing this stuff for the first time again. This is so exciting. This is awesome. Awesome. We're gonna take a look at it in detail and we're gonna show you some of the spots that are still here, some of the spots that used to be here that are not here anymore. And we're just gonna have a good look around and show everybody that hasn't seen this in person or may not be able to see it in person, we're gonna let you see it. We're gonna show you everything. It's gonna be a good day, guys. It's gonna be a good day, we got this. All right, so I have some bad news. Unfortunately, the fact that we just got here, we found out that these knobs are blocking skating, so we can't skate here. It's, it's knobs. <laughs> no idea why you would knob that sideways, but thank the Lord for whoever did that because we are still able to skate this place. <laughs> All right, so the way people skate this spot, Woo! The way people skate this spot is up this three and down the set, which is really cool. If you check out this old Bondo, this has been here since day one of skating. It's been in every famous video that I grew up watching. It's just something so cool that you may not get a chance to see through the footage because it happens so fast. But if you care about the history of the spot and just what goes into it, it's so cool to see this stuff. In Girl Yeah Right, uh, they filmed a invisible board scene here and all of this Bondo is original from Ty Evans. And that is one cool thing to see. I will uh, go up here where he filmed the shot and I will try and line it up my best so you can see it. This is what you're looking at when you're skating Belmont 9. No idea why in the world these are here, but <laughs> thank the Lord for who put them there. These rails are not probably the original ones. I want to say these are probably the second set of rails that had gone in and they are, they are secured. No one is skating these puppies. All right, cool. We're going to check out some other spots around here, find some goodies along the way. All right, so over here, as my friend said, we have the evil twin of the original Belmont 9. We have <laughs> the Belmont 9, uh, I'm supposed to say stepbrother. <laughs> a little bit longer, a little rough around the edges, and a little bit doper. This is the second rail that was put in here too. There wasn't a, there was an original rail that was in here, you can see. This place is filled with awesome spots, so we're gonna check out and see what else is around here. Let's see if we can find some, uh, see if we can find some snacks or, goodies along the way. Everyone's always leaving some loose change of food around here, so let's see what we can find. All right, nice. Looks like we didn't have to go far. We got some tahini, some milk, June night. Hell yeah, we got a nice healthy dessert in here too. Damn, let's take a bite of that. You sick bastard. It's crisp. <laughs> Want to take a bite? No. <laughs> One cool thing me and my friends like to do when we come to schools on the weekends to skate is see what they have in their vending machines. <laughs> it's pretty fun. Let's see what we got in here. Ooh. Thing that's nice to do is clean up these skate spots. Come here on the weekends and you thrash it and you destroy it. They're gonna know. So try and keep these spots clean. All right, we're gonna go check out. There used to be a very iconic manual pad over here. Unfortunately, it does not exist anymore. They had taken it out, um, but I would like to show you what it looks like now. Right here is where the original manual pad was, right here. It came straight across. You can see these cool cafeteria style dome roofs. 
Uh, they used to be multicolored. They are now just gray. This is iconic. I can't tell you how many photos I have seen of my favorite skaters and their favorite skaters all hanging out on these picnic tables while people are sessioning the mani pad or there used to be a ledge right there it is no longer there anymore um, but the nine and it's so cool just to leave up to your imagination the wonder of wow like look at these picnic tables and how long they have been skated these are the things that you just can't see in photos this is the stuff that is so cool to see these marks right here could have been from my favorite video part growing up. It's so cool to see all this stuff and to see the layers of paint that the school has had to add just to simply hide the skate history here. It's so awesome. I started this channel just to really give people an inside look at what these spots look like and what you're not able to see in photos and videos and magazines. And this is just so cool. I love seeing this stuff. It's almost like a movie location, filming location, behind the scenes, but I wanna bring these iconic skate spots to the world, to people that aren't able to see them and may ever not ever get the chance to come out to LA. Let's check out a view that no one ever gets to see in skate videos. Wow, look at this. You, know, you have a view of downtown. You got people playing sports. This is Echo Park. Energy's already here, the vibe's already set. It's just waiting for you to come do it, so. Wow, this is really cool. All right, folks, it looks like we've covered everything here at Belmont 9. I wanna thank my friend Chris for really believing in me to start this channel and taking me here. I just am so excited to show you guys all the spots I have in Los Angeles and we'll get you a real in-depth, in-person look at them. So let's do it, guys. Um, let's do it, it's gonna be a fun time. So if you have any questions or any comments, just shoot them in the comment below or message me. I hope you guys have a blessed rest of your day.